lastly, I want to talk about avoiding artificial attention. What is that? So for instance, whenever someone drops a plate inside of a restaurant and goes plang, and then everyone looks, so that's artificial attention. We didn't want to pay attention to it. It was because of an external cue. So if we want a child's attention, we'll go, Steve, like that. That's not that great because what you're doing is you're pairing the clapping with the attention. What it means is that you're teaching your child to respond to the clapping and their name. So every time you will have to clap in order to get their attention. It's not your problem. This is everyone's problem. We will speak in a higher tone like me just then I went Steve and then I had to go louder. I had to sometimes shout or whatever. These are also artificial attention is how you scream and shout to get their attention. But what you're doing is you're teaching them that you require this amount of energy in order for them to really react to you and that sucks because you cannot stay at that energy level for the whole day right you wouldn't want to do that so instead stay at your neutral tone and make sure that you have like good stuff to show him like play with him whenever you call for him have a reason behind it or else why would he look